One, two, one, two. You're now tuned in to the world famous Wake Up Show. We have a, a legend above legends, above legends. This is like Yoda of the industry. Hello? Is, is, is anybody there? Hello? One, two, one, two. Hello, hello. Hello? Tom? We're here. Tommy Boy Records, man. Are you there? Is Tom? Is, yeah, man. Is this true that Tommy Boy is coming back? Can you please yeah. introduce yourself, the legend that you are, man? It's Tom Silverman, Tommy Boy Music. Yes. Starting with Africa Bambada, De La Soul, Naughty by Nature, House of Pain, Digital Underground, Queen Latifah, Coolio, and so many more. I got the list. I got the list in front of me, man. I, I got. I, you got a holy printed it out. This I time. forgot. I forgot a lot. Of them. <laughs> I got. I got the list, man. I got Planet Patrol, <laughs> Africa Bambada, <laughs> Johnson Crew. This just the name a of pedigree. few. Globe and Wiz Kid, Latin Rascals single, which I never even knew that that Latin Rascals had a single. Rev, we got to get that. Um, TKA, Information Society, Club Nouveau, Stetsasonic, Force MDs, De La Soul, Queen Latifah. Uh, let me see. That's seven. Just, I'm, I'm still going. Now. Hold on, man. Hold on, hold on. We got we got some. Uh, we got Paris from the Bay, Digital Underground, 808 State, Fresh Go and Miz, Naughty by Nature, House of Pain, Hooligans. Coolio, Big Noid, Above the Law, Capone Noriega, Onyx Damn. Wu-Tang, and Damn. The Far Eye. I mean, that's just, Damn. I think that's half the list. So, I, I got to ask we, you, man. That's, that's a round of applause. Yeah, that's a on. round of applause. Yeah. That's, that's hip-hop right that, there, that's, man. That, 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 if that ain't hip-hop, I don't know what it is. Hell yeah. So, Tom, you, you, you are, I mean, I guess at that point in, in history, we got to say, really, Russell Simmons, Def Jam, and Tommy Boy, Tom Silverman, were Rev considered the the key pivotal moments in putting out music in, in for hip hop. Correct? Absolutely, pioneers that push it to the next stage, man. And Tom, I think, was first. I think Tommy Boy was before. Well, Def yeah, Jam he was doing a lot of innovation years, in, the early 80, in the early eighties. Yeah, you just said four years. Before. Four years before, absolutely, man. So, man, it's an honor talking to you. Uh, I'm DJ King Chap. We got my man Frank in the studio and DJ Revolution. We all grew up on Tommy Boy. Everything, you, you name it, man. I, I, you know, I had the pleasure of talking to um, Planet Patrol about a week ago about their their coming back or you guys are re-releasing yep. records. And so, can you talk about that? Because you know, not a lot of people know about that group Planet Patrol, Rev, and how yeah, important. I to Herb Jackson today. Uh, yeah, they're they're going out as a trio now. One of the guys died, one of the lead singers died, and one of the other guys left, so now they tour as a trio. They used to have five guys back in the day, but they sound really great. Harmonies, you know, you don't hear that much in hip-hop. That's true. Absolutely, and, he, and they, they started mentioning something about the return of Tommy Boy, and also you have an app or some, uh, 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 not an app. Uh, it's about uh, uh, stems. Stems. It's, 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 oh, yeah, I'll it's, tell you about it. Yeah, yeah break it down I'll a little bit, Tom. Yes. Yeah, so, so there's a, a new, you know, I started with Bambada, and we had the whole Planet Rock with the Kraftwerk thing, and then we had De La Soul, 27 samples, you know, on Three Feet High and Rising, and plenty of stuff, talking all that jazz, you know, with Lonnie Liston Smith, and, you know, sampling has been a nightmare to me since the beginning and all of my artists, and I thought there must be a better way, and the courts are fighting it out, and they all disagree with each other, so I thought, well, what if we came up with a, a system that uh, made it fast, easy, and affordable to create samples. So you can make a sample in five minutes without a lawyer for as little as fifty dollars. Mm. So it's just, and, and it's called Track Lib, like Track Liberation. Okay. Based out of Sweden, and um, it's going to change the way people make records because it'll be built into every um, digital audio workstation. So, uh, yeah, just so I understand it, uh, so I understand the time. So, if I want to sample something from the Tommy Boy catalog, I go through. What do I? How do I do it? You can go to Tracklib. You got to be registered in Tracklib, but it's still in beta, so you can't get in yet. Okay. But you can get online to get in when it opens. Uh, yeah, they have fifty-five thousand tracks up right now, and like forty-five labels signed up, and um, probably there'll be over a hundred thousand by March. And only three hundred thousand records have ever been sampled, so. You don't really need millions and millions, but we're getting really great stuff. So I've and been so to the site. To I've been to the site, and you know, um, I, I've seen it that it is in beta, and I've watched all the the little um, little info videos, and it's pretty. Um, it looks pretty dope, man. I'm just dying to get in and see how it works, man. Lift the hood up. When is it going live? It goes live probably in April, I think, and we're um, you know 
we're just starting to push the button now on press and there's about 2500 producers that are in using the system now and improving the user experience so by the time we launch you'll go crazy crate digging because you go in there and you never come out again you know one thing leads to another and you discover beat after beat you know and you want to download them and then so they're in your arsenal so when you're ready to use them you just have to click license and pay your fifty dollars or five hundred dollars and you're done so it's fifty to five hundred or five is there a yeah and the highest is twenty the highest is twenty five hundred for like big hits and then the stuff that's sort of you know smaller hits by the artists that didn't you know mid chart records would probably be 500 and everything else will be 50 like all the album cuts and b-sides and now are these have to think and peace the president was like a b-side and um the amen amen brother was a b-side so you know it's not always the a-side that becomes a sample hit of course and you know the more obscure so you're saying the more obscure it is the, it's you know the fifty dollar rate Deeper. like the dollar yeah. bin the obscure the new the internet dollar bin is fifty dollars <laughs> yeah but we want to encourage people to discover new samples and real deep diggers never want to use anything people used before of course for sure that's what that was my point in saying that is that i think it's great yeah. and that's what really uh got me interested is like wow okay so there's going to be that much stuff up there to dig through you know it's because you know I'm a producer and Texas producer. We do. We've done our share of digging in the crates, and you know we ha we know how to get around. But now it's a new age, and I, uh, I'm excited for kids to come up and use that system, mm -hmm. and see what happens to production after something like that hits the market. So yeah, well, Tech used to play vinyl, and th that required a different kind of dexterity and skill. Mm -hmm. You know, people with Serato or tractor or whatever don't have to do anything to mix. You know, it's not. It's not like what you grew up on. That's Same right. thing is going to be true for sampling. You don't have to sit and listen to vinyl in a little store in Peoria, you know, to hope you discover something. You can go through hundreds of thousands of tracks in seconds. You can choose by year of release and location. You can choose by beats per minute or even key. You know, there's so many things you can choose in genre and label and all this. And then it gives you stuff like SoundCloud where you can scrub through and find find the section you you know you think would could be a good break and it's all you know you know in advance how much a record's going to cost now yeah. when you clear a sample you don't even know if you, you can get the rights let alone what they're going to rip you off for yeah that's true so this is a lot easier and uh, less expensive that sounds amazing tom well, congratulations man um last question tommy boy records as far as your own catalog and the label and uh resurgence of the label what's going on with it so I just uh, uh, reacquired the catalog, Tommy Boy catalog, after 15 years. Okay. So we're now digitizing everything and uh, converting analog tapes to digital and talking to all the artists again and waking up that catalog, that 80s and 90s hip-hop, as obviously you know better than anybody, is about the hottest thing out there right now. So um, them streams you know, we're just... Yeah, I want to work with Planet Patrol. Like, I'm Rev, we going in, baby. I'm calling you for I just cuts. want all those De La Soul acapellas, man. So put them up. I'm good. I buy them all day. I'll, I'll pay $50 for me, myself, and I. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So then, then, then that's the next level. I didn't mention, yeah, they're going to have. If the song has stems available, the stems will also be available. And say, a De La Soul acapella would probably be a $4.99 download. Damn. But DJs could download it for $4.99, the WAV file, and they there, can, can use it. Damn. And it's amazing. You can just spin it, mix it into stuff that you're doing, and just drop yeah. it on top of things. So, you know, we're going to pull acapellas for most of our stuff, so they'll be available there. Well, congratulations, Tom. This is King Tech saying peace to you, man. And big fan. Like I said, my life started with Planet Patrol, yeah. African Mambada, looking for the perfect yeah. beat. Like, we go back. You don't even know, man. Like, it's, it's an honor that you're on the phone. Thank you for calling in. World Famous Wake Up Show. Yeah, we'll be Tom, right back, Tom, man. Tom Tom, you know what, Rev? Rev, you should, we should do a medley of all the damn joints I just named at some point. Yeah. That would be sick. Yeah. That would be sick. Let me put that We're going to do a tribute for you, Tom, for sure. It's going to take a long time. to. I was, I was trying to do that last night, and like it was like four hours, and it was still going. So. <laughs> Rev can do it, man. I'm telling you, oh, we yeah. have this cat named DJ Revolution that is amazing. He's going to put it together, man. World Famous Wake Up Show. Rev, Slice and Dice. You, I want to hear Slice and Dice. The one and only revolution. Thanks again, Tom. Check Thanks in with you time. later, my man. All right. Peace. Bye.